Hey guys, and welcome back to another review, dip review. Um, I just got myself at the store in Kodiak pouches. I, uh, I haven't made videos in a while. I'm really fucking tired right now, so it's going to be probably about three or four minutes long. So, I'm busy day today. I worked out at the Y for about four, four hours. Uh, I walked around for about three and just kind of hung out for the other hour, just missing in between. I haven't dipped that much today, only a few pinches of Grizzly in the morning. Now I got the, the strong stuff, the Kodiak Wintergreen. This is what I'm wearing today for a shirt, just some basketball shirt. I'm just trying to psych myself up because it's really fucking strong. I got a new, I found my other mud jug. This is my second mud jug. I'm going to get more mud jugs for Christmas. Uh, I'm just going to put the camera down and get the pinch ready. It's a pouch, by the way. So, I will go over the presentation. It's uh, pretty simple, really. Here's what the lid looks like. Kodiak. Warning, this product can cause mouth cancer. And it's got the Kodiak Bear. This is what the can looks like. Pretty simple stuff. Uh, metal top, plastic bottom. Um, metal lid, plastic bottom. So we're gonna get this going. I usually don't put more than one in, but I just feel like waking up right now. So, I'm just gonna put the pouches and my lip. And I'm good. Now these ones are taking a little while to moisten up. There it is. Um, grizzly pouches are a complete rip off. It's cheap shit. But as I'm noticing right now, as soon as I put the pouches in my lip, I can already, I'll already feel um, the nicotine starting to kick in. I'm just feeling good right now. Um, it just hit me. It's just a little bit of a rush, a head rush. Um, this is the stuff you want to get if you're having a hard time getting a buzz off dip. Maybe you go for the Kodiaks because I need to get to myself some of this long cut. This is really, really good stuff. The difference between this and the Grizzly pouches, they both sell them at A1 Plus Convenience. Um, and that's right down the street for me. And then pretty much all it is is just different. It's a different type of feeling. It's a different type of buzz. Um, you know, it's good. It's good stuff. The Kodiak's way better than the Grizzly pouches. Do not get Grizzly pouches unless you're really new at it. But... I usually don't let anything sip, but for some reason it's nice and good because it's the pouch. Probably going to ramble on. Like, if you're new to my videos, if anybody's that many people are watching, I know that my old video got, like, my first video got 38 views. That's good enough for me. So I'm hoping that if you know anybody who wants to new, learn a little bit about dip, don't go to me. Go to Suit and Tie, Dip and Chew Guy. And his backup is uh, Dirty Pat Walsh, so... So yeah, now I'm starting to uh, I'm starting to get the the nicotine rush. People will say, "Oh, I don't get a buzz from Grizzly." Well, it's pretty obvious because there's nothing to it. Grizzly Wintergreen is good, but the Grizzly pouches just it's just a little bit of a nicotine rush. That's it. But this is this is pretty strong. I'm having a hard time uh, holding the phone right now. A little bit uh, a little bit lightheaded. I wouldn't do this in the streets or anything because it make me make me feel like shit. Something like something like that. Probably gonna go on for about one more minute, and then I'm gonna. Uh, my my plan is is to later tonight, if I feel up to it, to get uh, to get this is one of my crosses by the way. I'm gonna make to show people why I got nothing to do. This is one of my crosses, my only cross I have, right there. See, and I usually wear this, but I won't wear it in a religious in a tobacco video because I find it disrespectful to God. So. But it's right there. It's watching every single move I make. <laughs> so now I'm just kind of relaxing. It's kind of getting in there. Um, I just got a good juice. You can tell you get a good juice when you feel, feel it in your lips. These are pretty good packed pouches, if that makes sense. So, yeah, that's pretty much it for this one. Um, it's about $10 a, a can at uh, regular stores. Not many stores have Kodiak pouches. So I don't know any, any of the details about it online. But I would suggest anybody looking to know about dip and more dip reviews because I just I don't really feel up to making these that much. 
So just go to Suit and Tie, Dip and Chew Guy, and Dirty Pat Wallace is pretty good too. So that's it for this one, guys. And there will be more review. One more review maybe coming within the next few days. See you later. God bless.